Hey everybody, it's Mike here coming to you from world famous Cordy Mazza, great place to be. This is a little video for all you great people out there, all you wonderful people checking out our inventory from the comfort of your own home. This is a 2022 Matt, uh, Ford, Ford Escape SEL all-wheel drive. Check it out, 2022 Ford Escape SEL all-wheel drive. 1.5 liter EcoBoost turbo with the eight speed automatic transmission. It's got a really nice set of Michelin tires on there. Check out those tires. Look at those nice shiny rotors on those brakes as well. Those tires do have a mud and snow rating. You can drive them all year round. This is a very fuel efficient vehicle SUV from Ford. It has um, a powerful three turbocharged three cylinder engine and an eight speed automatic transmission. I think I mentioned this a couple times, but that's really cool from Ford. It's a great little combination to get you going and get you very fuel efficient in a very fuel efficient way. You got folding mirrors, there's a blind spot and monitoring system on the inside of the mirror, and um, it's got all sorts of really good safety features with lane keep assist and autonomous braking. Check out the front bumper of this thing, awesome condition. You got that big old grill there, you got some headlight, you got some nice clear headlight lenses. Um, underneath the hood, is it's been all checked out from our shop. We've given an oil change, complete safety inspection. We also have all the lean searches and car proofs done on this vehicle. Check out the passenger side. Also in really, really nice condition. This car looks like it's new. It's pretty darn nice. Tinted windows, got a bit of chrome there, a little bit of swoops and swishes. There's your indicator. Uh, there's a blind, bright yellow light that'll come on there for blind spot monitoring system. Got this nice little door panel. There's a speaker built into that little bit of brushed aluminum along the door panel that continues along along the dash as well I've got all the owners manuals in here ready to go for the next driver and it does have full leather seats perforated on the part you're sitting on solid bolsters a little bit of storage underneath the armrest there there's your cup holders with the keys and it's got push button start there's your transmission, eight-speed automatic. You got some plugins up there as well, USB, etc. It does have this big old glass roof, so you got a big panoramic roof up there, and underneath that is your side curtain airbags that drop down from the ceiling in the event of a collision. You also have airbags that come out of the seat as well, so super safe, uh, very fuel efficient, fun to drive. What's not to like? Back here, uh, lots and lots of room for your rear passengers getting in and out of the Rear seat here, uh, it's a nice height to get in and out of. I've got some good visibility. I can tell the driver's gonna really enjoy uh, being able to see around them very well. And there's the spot to be right there behind the steering wheel. Uh, back here, these seats do fold down. If you wanna get a bit more uh, storage, you can put those seats down. You go, it goes nearly flat. Uh, great for the dog, good for road trips. Uh, or if you gotta pick up something extra big at the hardware store or whatever. And, uh, and I think, actually, yeah, you can recline these back seats too, which is kind of nice. So lots of positioning here, very comfortable. There's also armrest with some cup holders here as well. Let's go check out the hatch. See what it's like in the back here. So got a dual exhaust system. It's got park distance control. There's one of the exhaust over there. You got the other one over on that side. It's got a backup camera. You got that rear windshield wiper. It does have a power lift gate on the back. So you just open says me back here. And then you can see it's got a 60-40 a split rear folding seat. There's a power source here, some grocery hooks. Underneath here is your spare tire tools and equipment. And Ford did a really good job of insulating the vehicle. It's very, very quiet to drive around in. And uh, you got that spare tire there ready to go. So that's the back end of this thing. Just push the button, close says me. Really, really nice design. I like the little uh, cutouts back here. Big old tail light lenses. It's got a very shapely uh, look to it. Check out that styling and the way they shape the metal is really nice from Ford. So that's the outside of the vehicle. Let's see what it's like behind the driver's seat. Give you a little bit more of an idea of what it's like to be a driver. So you've got full adjustment on the power seat here, up and down, forward and back, um, recline, and see if there's Oh yeah, you can you can actually tilt and rock the seat as well. It looks like over in front of my left knee, I've got I can open and close the rear door. Here's my power or my my headlight control. You got your dash lights. It's got automatic headlights. There's your power um, mirror control. You can adjust those however you want. Your power windows. And as I was mentioning before, I think 
uh, you got that bright yellow light that comes on in the dat or on the outside rear view mirror there to indicate if someone's in your blind spot if you're traveling in the same direction. Up on the dash here, uh, it's got just a little over 84,000 kilometers. You got your tachometer, outside air temperature, tells you your posted speed limits. Some of your lane departure warning systems, got your idle off feature. Uh, your speedometer, your fuel gauge, and, and uh, temperature control. On the steering wheel here, you got your adaptive cruise control settings and your uh, um, lane departure settings here as well. And accelerate, decelerate. Over on this side of the steering wheel, you've got your Bluetooth, and you can go through some of your menu items here. Ford does a really good job of of making these cars uh, pretty techy and very user friendly. It does have all your Bluetooth and navigation up here. Um, let's see here, navigation. So there's there's your nav, it's got your Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, and when you put it into reverse, of course, you got the, that nice um, backup camera to let you know where you're coming and going. Also has that park distance control system over there. Back in the park, uh, you got a dual zone climate control system, heated seats and heated steering wheel, and you got a couple plugins down below, and nice easy spot to grab your, your, uh, your drinks from your cup holders here, electronic parking brake. Multiple drive modes means that you can have um, normal, eco, sport, slippery, and steep snow and sand. So this thing should be able to go pretty much anywhere that you need it to. Uh, I noticed that when you put it in the deep snow and sand, it turned the traction control off, which makes a lot of sense so that you can kind of, if you got to spin yourself free of something, uh, that'll work really well for that. Um, so that's about it. Uh, let's check out the stereo. So we'll see how that sounds. Uh, not that's it. You got a nice loud stereo in here too. So that's the 2022 Ford Escape. If you or somebody knows in the market for a good SUV, come check this one out. Take it out for a spin. You'll probably really like it. Uh, it's in really nice condition. It smells good. Uh, give me a call, 250-338-5777. Email me, mike at CourtneyMazza.com. Thanks for watching, everybody, and have a great day.